Hey, it's Rob Balasabas. In this video, I want to answer the question, is StreamYard free? That's the first question. And which will answer the second, the first question here. The second question is what does StreamYard cost? All right. So let me share my screen and let's jump into it. All right. So the first question is really easy. StreamYard can be free, but it also is a paid uh, platform as well. So you can see here, this is directly from the StreamYard uh, pricing page. Now this is as of today's recording, which is June 9th, 2022. Um, here's what I'm going to do. If you are looking at StreamYard and you're not sure which pricing plan to go with, which one fits you the best, then let me know in the comments down below of this video, let me know which platforms you want to stream into, whether it's YouTube, Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitch, let me know which platforms you want to stream into. All right. Then also let me know if you're going to be planning to record any content, any videos um, that's not going to be streamed, that you just want to record videos. All right. And then also if there's any specific features with StreamYard, with live streaming that you want to accomplish, let me know in the comments. All right. So let me know those three things in the comments. Take a pause and then let me know, and then I will let you know exactly which plan work, would work best for you, all right? So I wanna help you out there. I wanna get you started. If that's a stumbling block, let's address that right away. That's a really easy win for us, all right? Now, the next thing I want you to do is go down, down below in the description of this video. You're gonna find a link that will take you to a 14-day free trial with StreamYard. Now, I want you to go and take advantage of that go with the highest plan available, the professional plan, get a 14 day free trial of the professional plan. That way you can use all of the different features that StreamYard has to offer. And then within those 14 days, you can then decide, hey, you know what? This is really important for me, but you know what? This is not, right? You know what? I need full HD. Or maybe you'll say, you know what? I don't need full HD, so I don't need the professional plan. I can go with the basic plan, all right? so. Go and get that free trial right away. Sign up for that so you can get your hands on the platform and you can start figuring out which plan would work best for you. All right. So as far as the StreamYard pricing plan, again, this could change by the time you watch this video. Could have changed already massively or a little bit. But as of right now, there are monthly and annual plans. Of course, if you go annual, then you can save a little bit of money. All right but you can go monthly or annual, all right? Make sure you're looking at that. Now there's a free version. With a free version, you're gonna get the StreamYard branding, all right? You're gonna get a little watermark at the corner of your live stream videos that says StreamYard, all right? Now, if you wanna take that out, you do have to go into the basic plan. Uh, you're also gonna get streaming limits, all right? You're gonna only be able to stream up to 20 hours per month on the free plan. Now for you, you might be like, hey, I just need to stream once a week or once every two weeks for an hour, 20 hours is plenty of time. So that's great. If so, the free plan is great for you. Now you can also uh, bring in guests into your live stream. And so on the free plan, you can bring up to six people into the stream. If you wanna bring in more people than that, you can have up to a maximum of 10 people. You will have to upgrade to the basic or the professional plan. All right. now. Next, let's move into the basic plan. All right, there's two paid tiers here. Actually, there's a third. We're not. We're going to talk about that in just a second. But there is a basic plan for twenty dollars a month if you're paying annually, twenty five dollars a month if you're paying monthly, and then also there's a professional plan that's thirty nine dollars per month if you're paying annually upfront or forty nine dollars a month if you're paying month to month. That's your professional plan. Now those plans will allow you to put in your own logo, really brand your live stream, right? You want to do that, especially if you're doing live streams on a regular basis. You want to build your personal brand. You want to put your logo, right? You want to put overlays, right? Overlays are the things that kind of the images that will go over your uh, stream, your videos. You can put backgrounds, custom backgrounds. You can set up RTMPs. Now, RTMP basically will allow you to live stream on different platforms that may not have a direct integration with StreamYard. If you have any questions around RTMP, pause this video, go into the 
comments and let me know what questions you have about RTMP. And I'll make sure that we answer that for you as well. Now, you can also do pre recorded streams. So you can stream pre recorded videos. So if I recorded a video, I can then set that up to stream as if it was live. And I can go in the comments or I can have one of my team members be in the comments to engage with the live viewers. On the basic and the professional plan, I can also record six hours per stream. Now, this is really important. If you are looking to take your live streams and repurpose them, take clips from them, post it on other platforms, things like that, you may want to record a podcast or create shorts or reels um, or TikToks out of your clips from your streams. That's really important that you're able to record your live streams. And then finally, on the basic plan, you can multi-stream up to three destinations. So what this means is that you're now able to go not just stream to say YouTube, you can stream to YouTube, your Facebook group, and also to Twitch at the same time. All right, maybe not Twitch. Twitch has some rules with multi-streaming, but maybe then you can live stream to Twitter or you can live stream to LinkedIn at the same time, all right? And all of those comments from all of those different platforms, all of those streams will be coming into StreamYard and it's gonna be all in one place. It's gonna be super easy to manage all of your comments, all right? Back to the screen. Now, when it comes to the professional plan, there's a few things there that you get that you don't get from the other two plans, all right? So if we're gonna go down and scroll through here, you're gonna get a little bit more recording time, okay? 10 hours versus six hours. You're gonna also be able to multi-stream to eight destinations. You're also gonna be able to stream in full HD, 1080p. You're also going to be able to download individual audio recordings, very important, for those of you that are podcasting. And if you wanna take your video and turn it into a podcast, very important. And then lastly, for the fancy gear heads, you can also use multiple cameras, which is very cool. You know, have one camera over your uh, desk, one camera behind you, one camera in front of you, uh, pointing at you, you know, one side camera, like a B-roll camera and that sort of thing. So you can do that as well on the professional plan. Now, there is a fourth plan here, which is StreamYard Business. Now, for any very serious business-centric, maybe you have multiple channels, you have a huge team, then there are plans for you as well. Maybe these uh, plans here, these three plans up top, maybe a little too small for you, need something a little bit larger, more, bigger package, then you want to contact the StreamYard team, and you can do that by clicking the Contact Sales button right here. All right? So... Again, to recap, three different plans with a fourth business plan here. Very easy, very straightforward. Uh, I want you to now let me know if you haven't already. Again, like I said, take advantage of this. I, I wanna help you. First, make sure you set up StreamYard. The link is down below for a 14-day free trial. And then let me know in the comments how many channels you wanna stream into, if you wanna be recording any of your streams, and if there's any specific features with StreamYard or with live streaming platforms that you're looking for. And I'll do my best to make sure that I suggest the proper plan that you should be going into, all right? So with that, thank you for watching. I hope this helps you. One thing I wanna mention, final, final, I swear, is that I've actually created a course called StreamYard 101. I'll link it down in the bottom as well. This is a course that will take you from A to Z of how to use StreamYard and stream like a pro using StreamYard. And again, you can do that. It's an on-demand course. You can go through it. And then I will also be available inside of that platform where you can ask me questions directly. And so I hope you take advantage of that. I want you to be a, an awesome pro with using StreamYard for creating content and growing your audience. And again, hopefully that helps you. And I'll see you in the next video. Take care.